Hey guys, welcome back to our show. I'm Carter. I'm Avery. I'm Cambry. Um, yeah, we don't really have a plan for today's episode. <laughs> um, we're thinking of venturing away from the movie reviews and TV show reviews. Maybe just asking a couple questions to each other so you guys can maybe get to know us a little more. They'll maybe be related to the movies or whatnot, but <laughs> I don't know. Um, to start off, let's start off with something simple. Avery, what's your favorite movie or TV show? Uh, I don't have a favorite TV show, but I've been starting to watch The Long King Kong. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. Long Kingdom. I don't really know what it's about. It's, Not gonna lie. I like. Yeah, I just watched a little bit of it. I didn't really get too into it, but it was pretty good when I watched. Yeah. Cambry, what's your favorite movie and or TV show? Um, I don't know. Right now, I'm watching. Um... Hmm. Oh, right now I'm watching One Tree Hill. Yeah, that's pretty good. I've already seen like most of it. Yeah. My favorite movie. I don't know. I really like the Creed movies. Mom Mia. <laughs> no, those are good ones. They're really good. I don't know. I have a lot of favorite movies and TV shows. Yeah. Um, personally, my favorite TV show would be Criminal Minds. Really obsessed with that. Don't know why. But it's good. And my favorite movie is probably Ooh, that's a hard one. It's probably Greater. That's the name of the movie. I don't know if you guys have ever heard about that, but it's like based on Oh no. Okay, I'm changing my mind. My favorite movie is Rust Creek. It's like oh, I personally and I tried to watch that. But I kind of fell asleep, so... I, a lot of people don't like it, but I think it's really good. It's based on a true story, so that's what I like. And it's got a good plot to it, so... I also love Grey's Anatomy. Yeah, Grey's Anatomy's good. I tried to get into that, but the episodes were, like, too long for me, I think. Yeah. I don't know. Oh my gosh. It's really good, though. I love Shit's Creek. Yeah, that's really a good one, too. It's, a, it's like, like, it's so fun. Mm-hmm. It's, I don't know, it's really funny. It's just really easy to follow, like, there's not really a plot, it's just like... Yeah. Yeah. I also, I also love New Girl. You ever watch that? A lot of people don't like it because they just couldn't get into it. Like, my mom, she said she just couldn't get into it, but I watched all of the seasons, like, within a month. Mm-hmm. I just kept watching it. It was just... I was addicted. Yeah. But it was really good. Well, right now, Carter and I are both watching Euphoria. Avery, have you seen it? I've heard of it, but it doesn't yeah. seem interesting to me. It is. It, it's at first, very like, good. the first couple episodes, I was like... It's weird. It, it's it is very, weird. like, it uh, shows There's some a very lot. explicit, explicit yeah. scenes and... It, don't watch Whatever. it with your parents. Yeah, do not watch it with your parents. <laughs> but um, it's really good. It's really good. Um, Like, the first couple episodes, it took me, like, two weeks to watch the first two episodes. Because I was, like... The second season uh, is so uh, good. Whatever. But now I'm... Last night, I finished a couple episodes, and I started the second season. The second really season good. is very good. Mm-hmm. Very dramatic. It's... There's a lot of drama and oh, a lot of violence and yeah. a lot of stuff. Drugs. So. Oh, but it's a good show. It yeah. really is. Um, do you guys have any questions you would like to ask? Do you guys believe in mermaids? I do. Mermaids? Yeah. I think my mom okay. said mermaids. Yeah, because like... Okay, I do too. 
I there's like a book to do it and stuff down there. Yeah, it's well, like it's how like, much of the ocean have we discovered? There's like eighty percent of it that we haven't discovered. Yeah, it's like, like and like I feel like there's it, it might not be like a human like thing. I feel like it's not but, like a stereotypical mermaid. Right. But it, there's definitely something down there that's like a human. Yeah. Cause yeah. like monkeys, like evolution, like you know what I mean. Mm-hmm. It's like some like okay, like there's so definitely say, things down there that we don't that's my phone. we don't know everything obviously okay so like how evolution is like we started as algae okay and then we just kept growing and the fish and then the fish started exactly. walking and then it just like keeps so going what's but, to say that so if we like evolved from fish to monkeys to humans what's and there's still fish what's to say those fish didn't evolve into into, more and like, more and more in the because obviously how many Perfect. different types of like sea creatures are there that are so different? There has to be a mermaid down there. I has believe to be. sure. Do I, you guys believe in aliens? No. Okay. I, 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 I do. do. I, I do. do. I but don't not think like the little sticky or like Yeah, I don't think they're like green things. with big heads. And no, but I definitely I think they believe, look like humans. Like extraterrestrial life, I definitely believe in it because like, again, how many like there's no way that we are the many? only planet. Like, there are other planets that can sustain life. And there's, like, like, millions I mean, and millions galaxies. of galaxies and universes. And, like, and there, space, you're telling me there's space zero is just other like, living things out never there? never-ending, isn't it? It's just, like, ev- like Yeah, it just, just keeps like, on going. You're telling me there's nothing else out there. Exactly. If there's, or like, not life other, on other planets. Yeah, if like, there's at yes, least not there other is. humans, there has to be a planet that, like, grows plants and there probably has is. animals. Like, like, there's definitely life on other planets. There's def- I definitely believe in aliens. That makes, like, I don't really care. It's true. Yeah. It has to be. It's just, like, mermaids and oceans. Like, how, there's so much that we just have no idea. Right. Like, I don't know. Gabriel, any questions? Um, I'll have to think of one. So, you know how, like, NASA used to explore the ocean yeah. when they were first, like, yeah. founded or whatever? And, and then sense. they, like, just switched and went to space. Like, just to, like, to space. Yeah, but, like, that, like, scares me a little bit. Like, do you think they, like, found something to where they're, like, let's no. try to get off this planet what's down there that we don't want to go near anymore. But like, then, you know? like, other people started doing sea exploration. I think it'd be so cool to do that, but I think I'd get really scared. I'm scared of that kind of stuff. Like, like being I, too deep underwater, just the yeah. thought of, like, something going wrong and like me really dying because I can't get to the surface quick enough to get air. I can really even swim. Not that I'd be swimming, but, like, you know what I mean? I can't swim Like, well going in a submarine be cool, but it's be, it'd be so scary. But my biggest fear is, like, if I was, like, scuba diving, like, my biggest fear would be, like, my oxygen not working, and then I don't swim to the top. And then I just, like, panic, and I, and I use even more. Yeah, like, that's my biggest fear. Oh my gosh, that's back to my other favorite movie, I Love the Titanic. Have you seen the movie, um, 47 Meters Down? Yes! yes. That movie just yeah, that was really scary. It, it really it wasn't, wasn't that scary, scary but I watched it with like my brothers, and in every suspenseful movie I watched with my brothers, they always try to scare me, and I'm, a very, a, I'm a very jumpy person, like, when I'm focused and, like, watching on the movie to see what happens next, and you scare me, I'm gonna, like, jump or whatever, so, like, they kind of ruined that kind of stuff for me. Yeah. Like, Jaws. <laughs> like, I like that was a movie. I love them. Like it was a good movie. The movie wasn't yeah. scary, but I got scared every time I watched it. I love my brothers. brothers. Um, if you could like have like a meal or like spend a day, like have dinner with like any three people like in the world, who would it be? Can they be dead? They have to be alive. Uh-huh. You answer the question. Michael B. Jordan. Uh, <laughs> mm, I don't know. Okay, Michael B. Jordan for sure. And then I'd probably do.
do, like, I'm thinking, like, celebrity-wise. I would do Michael Jordan. Maybe, like, Gigi Hadid. She's, like, I don't know. Or Bella. I'd do one of those, too. And then... Ooh. Like somebody fun, like Kevin Hart. Yeah, I would do Machine Gun Kelly. Ooh. Um. <gasps> no, I forgot. Let me change my answer. You finish and then I'll no, change my answer. Okay. okay. So I would definitely bring Morgan Wallen to sing to me and just like do funny. I feel like he's such a fun guy. So Morgan Wallen, Michael B. Jordan, and then probably like Gigi or Bella Hadid. Okay. <laughs> Wait, what did I say? You said Machine Gun Kelly. Okay, Machine Gun Kelly, Fuzzco. Oh my gosh, Angus Cloud, yep. Angus Cloud. I forget I his first name. I can't just choose like three people. Oh Angus Cloud, I would spend the rest of my life. Oh, he's <laughs> Even He's J up. Even Jacob Elordi, he is not a nice guy in Euphoria, but, but he so, is in real life. He's so... Oh, oh and man. Tom Holland. I, I've just had, like, forever... I could just I've keep looked, going yeah. with my list. Those three. Angus Cloud, Tom Holland, and MGK. Hey, Rihanna, what are you here? Um, Snoop Dogg. Oh, that's a good one. It has to be alive? Yes. yes. I guess. <laughs> Snoop, Snoop Dogg, Megan Fox, and... Hmm. Probably Adam Sandler. Or Adam. Will Ferrell. I love um, both of those. Yeah, yeah those, one those of those. Are good ones. I'd probably change MGK to Megan Fox on mine because I like it. What if they each got a plus Fox. one? Who would their each of their plus ones be? Okay, well, Michelle <coughs> Kelly's would be Megan Fox. Yeah. <laughs> um, Let's see. Angus Cloud. Angus Cloud. Ashtray. Ashtray. Whatever his name is. Yeah, whatever his name is. Ashtray and then Zendaya. <coughs> For Tom. She, I love Zendaya. I love Zendaya. Oh, she's another one I could see. Yeah, I would switch out Tom Holland and bring in Zendaya and then Zendaya can bring Tom Holland. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, so I got Angus Cloud, Zendaya, and Megan Fox. Those are my three. Final three. Right there. For me, okay, Gigi Hadid's plus one would be... Bella or, or it would be Blake Lively. Oh, she's a maybe good one. I should have done Blake Lively. Okay, maybe I should have done Blake Lively, and then he she brought Ryan Reynolds. Oh, I'm changing yeah, that. That's yeah. what it's gonna be. Blake Lively brings Ryan Reynolds. Michael B. Jordan. Hmm. Brings Chris Evans. Yes, <laughs> I'll do that. I mean, that's a good idea. I was gonna say, um, what's his face? The guy, no, actually, never mind. And then Morgan Wallen would bring, ooh. Okay, I was gonna say Hardy because I feel like they'd be oh. so fun. Like, they're yeah. best friends. So, like, they would be so fun. But then I'm, like, trying to think, like. It would definitely be very good. Yeah, I think I'd go with that. I would have Snoop Dogg bring Ice Cube. Yeah. <laughs> um, Megan Fox. Probably NGK. And Will Ferrell. Breaks out of the Adam Sandler. <laughs> <laughs> Those are good ones. Those are all really good ones. Um, okay, what's another question? If 
you could travel anywhere right now, where would you go? Like for free, like just wherever. That's like such a hard question, why to ask that? Um, if I could travel anywhere right now for free, Bora Bora. I've always wanted to go there. I don't know why. Yeah. Probably Jamaica. Yeah. Um, hmm. I think I'd want to go somewhere, pretty much anywhere that has like an ocean, like Hawaii, like it has the beach, ocean, and then it has like all the mountains and stuff, you know? I think it'd be cool to go to like Italy or Spain. I always wanted to go to Greece. Yes, Greece, because that's where Mamma Mia takes place, and I love it. Also, like, Ireland, Australia. Ooh, oh, I also want to go to Iceland. Mm -hmm. I don't know why I want to go to I want to go to Ireland really bad. And, like, in the U.S., I really want to go to Mount Rainier in, um, like, Washington. Also, for some reason, I really want to go to, like, the Smoky Mountains. We're going to go there, but we're not. We're going to Yellowstone. <coughs> um, what's your favorite breed of dogs? Dog breed, I guess. Ooh. All-time favorite. That's... You can't pick two. I need you to, like, pick one. have a list. Just one. I need to like look them up so I like can remember all of them. Oh, that's hard. What's yours? Mine would be a golden retriever. <gasps> that's what I was gonna say. Camper is like a golden retriever. <laughs> <laughs> we'll talk about spirit animals next. Okay. Um, <laughs> I would probably pick can a long-haired chihuahua. I think they're so cute. Chihuahua? <laughs> yeah. oh, no. Why are you? I know I don't they're so scary. They're so scary. You could have chosen like a husky. Okay, 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 fine. Something. A long haired wiener dog. Okay. Okay, that's a little weird. Come on. Yeah. Chihuahuas okay. are so scary. They're like scary. Rico? Dogs. Yeah. Rico is so fat. <laughs> He's not going to do anything to you. Okay, yeah, but I little chihuahuas, all oh, those are scary. Okay, lighters. I wouldn't choose them, but I love Doberman Pinchers. They're like really like they're like the really big ones. So yeah. Like the ears. Okay, I, I would say head. maybe. Oh my god. Okay, I would say a gold retriever, but she already said that, and I'm gonna choose a different answer. Even though if you hadn't said gold retriever, I would have picked gold retriever. Okay. I'm gonna go yes, with. So <laughs> I'm gonna go with the St. Bernard, because. I love so birds. They're so cute. cute as puppies. Or the golden doodle. Oh yeah, my cousin has one of those. I'll choose the same for my though. Okay. Okay, what? We'll each give each other your spirit animal. Okay. What do you think Carter says? Carter's like. I was gonna say like a unicorn, but like that's not an actual They don't animal. exist. <laughs> no, I'm just saying if they did. Okay. You would be. I feel like you're gonna hurt my feelings out here. No. <laughs> Maybe like a little bunny rabbit. A bunny? Don't you think? Maybe. Maybe. What are you thinking? Or like Maybe. a seahorse. I don't know why you give off seahorse <laughs> vibes. What do you think? You're a dolphin. She's, no, don't you think? She's yeah, definitely a dolphin. A dolphin. <laughs> dolphin? Yep. That's yours. Okay. Dolphin. What's I met a dolphin once. Her name was Bibbidi. <laughs> no, you're a dolphin. I was going to say, or you could be a sea turtle, but no. No, I don't. Nah. I don't you're not I a don't sea get turtle. I don't get a sea turtle. I'm a dolphin. Okay, Avery? You're like... Hmm. I'm feeling like horse. I'm kind of 
getting those vibes too. Horse girl? <laughs> yeah. No, not like, like a horse girl. You're like, like a horse that the horse girl loves. Like you're, <laughs> I'm you're feeling like, like spirit. Like, you'd be of the like spirit show. Oh my god! Yeah, you're definitely like, like a, a wild saying. horse. Okay. Like a mustang. Yeah, I'm definitely. And you that. run really, really fast. You're like super fast, and you can like yeah. And you don't want people to bark you. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Every. <clears throat> Other than a golden retriever. Okay. Because we all know that that's... Mouse. Yep, see it. You're really quiet. Um, okay, I'm but mouse. if... You talk like this. Like, okay, you're I'm so actually so not so that so quiet, so quiet And you love cheese and you're like... I don't even <laughs> eat cheese. Okay, find a cat because you hiss at people still. No, I don't. <laughs> Whatever. Kylie did that. I never hissed at anybody. <laughs> <laughs> um, I can see you being like... Not a mouse, because that's just not even true. <laughs> it is. Even though you don't like mouse, you still kind of give off their vibes. Like, I can see you as, like, a little rabbit. That's what Seth Donkey told me. <laughs> <laughs> he told me I'd be a little <coughs> bunny rabbit. What? Okay, <laughs> I'll, be, I'll tell you guys the answers that I've received. We should cut this part out, but basically. Yeah. And so I was like asking. So this kid from Miller told me that I was an eagle because I'm. Oh, and Carter. then. Carter. Chrome. And then. I didn't know what you were talking about me. Yeah. <laughs> and then. Tyler, I was like, what's my spirit animal? Don't say us. Don't say an eagle. And he's like, okay, fine, a seagull. <laughs> and he didn't. Know. Okay, and then somebody, okay, else, right. somebody else called me. A lion. Who? No. No. <laughs> right? Oh, no. Okay. He called me a lion. Why? I don't Could know. Could you be lion? I don't know. He Could just said lion. I was a lion. <laughs> and then Seth Donkey said I was a bunny. And I told him <laughs> that he was giving off, like, fox vibes. Because he's stupid. <laughs> he's a stupid. You told me that he had a girlfriend. I didn't tell you that Jackson. Tyler did. Tyler did. He definitely doesn't. Just because he flirts with you doesn't mean he doesn't have a girlfriend. No, I, he literally told me he doesn't. Doesn't mean he still might be in a relationship. He's not. We talked about it. Addie was talking to this guy. Not like actually talking, but like he just like they Snapchatted or whatever. And he told her that him and his girlfriend broke up two weeks ago and they were still together. And it was Justine's friend, oh. and the girlfriend oh. was gonna forgive him after That's after ooh. Addie found out she he still had a girlfriend. Addie was like, "No, like he did all this stuff. Like here's all the proof. Send it to her." And so she said, Justine sent it to the girlfriend, and the girlfriend was like, "Oh well, okay, whatever. It's okay. I'll figure it out. Yada yada yada." What's your guys' dream job? Like, not Stay at home, mom. I don't want to work a day <laughs> in my life. I would be like. I would be like. An NFL mom who, like. Does things for charity. <laughs> okay. And, like, helps the I, whole country. Okay. Real, real life. Mm -hmm. Okay. I would First, like to be a stay at home mom, but I think that don't don't have to work. I would like to be an NFL wife. I clean I'd like to be an NFL wife, so I'd be okay with me. Yeah. Um but realistically like a pharmacist. Yeah. I'd be a pharmacist. I would be like a doctor of some sort. I'd make less I'd make bank. Like an oncologist. Oh don't say that that sounds funny. It's a cancer doctor. It's a cancer doctor. Or I'd be like a traveling, like a nurse. I can see as like an OBGYN. No. No. Yeah, I can. I just told you I can. I'm just saying that. No, thank you. <laughs> but like, not the one that like delivers the baby. The one that like after the baby's Checks born, you like clean them up and stuff, and then you put them in their like little robes. Aren't those like the nurses? They're like the little assistant people. Yeah. 
No, I would be a traveling nurse, too. Oh, you would? My grandma was a traveling nurse, and she was broke, so don't do that. <laughs> She's just broke because what she had about, cancer. What about yes. Saying that's attractive. There are some other ones out there. It's attractive if you're a running back, not necessarily so if you. No, if you. If you're a running I'm back, get up, Camry. No, that's she'll not think what I'm you're saying. hot no matter I'm just, what. I'm just you trying just to say the not. words running and back, and she's all over you. No, that's not what I'm saying. What I'm saying is, I think the most attractive football position is a running back because they're like. Yeah. They run fast. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think. I'd be an NFL wife, two a running back, probably wait a while to have kids. Um, no, you pop the babies out right away. No. Make him stay with you, girl. And then <laughs> I'd just, like, we'd, like, help a lot of people, be nice people, you know? Mm-hmm. With, uh, with all of our be money. Be nice to people. With all of our money, we'd, like, help people in, like, third world countries and stuff. Oh, you're so nice. That's what I would be. Spending your husband's money. <laughs> No, but like, yeah, yeah. You're not sure. It's fine. I I have be another s- job because I get bored really easily. Like I'd actually have a job. Um, I wouldn't. Or I'd just like my job is to be take an Insta- care. I'd be like an Instagram <laughs> wife, and that's how I'd make all my money. Oh uh, yeah. I, honestly, I changed my answer. I want to be an influencer. I don't like like that kind of stuff, but, but just to make it's money. a pretty decent way to get money without having like an actual employer. Yeah, career. I would be like an Instagram, <coughs> her, like an influencer. I could post vlogs like. about my day, and I could make TikToks. I could post on Instagram. Like I can do this stuff. Um. Okay. Well, we still have so much time. What, okay, let's ask one more, like, really crazy question. Um, Do you think we will be living on the moon within the next 20 years? No. Why not? I don't know, I just don't think so. Yeah, I don't really either. It's yeah. like, 20 years seems like a long time, but it's really not for that kind of stuff. I don't think we'll be on the moon until... I think my grandkids will be, like, on the moon. I don't know, I just think that's a long ways away. Great kids. What would you name your, like, first child? Girl name and boy name. Okay, girl name. I need to look at my list. Yeah, me too. You have a list? I have a list. Oh my god. You don't have a list? I don't have a list. I have a list. (laughs) Um, I don't know, I kind of like the theme of, like, cities. So, like, maybe, like, Dallas. For a boy, I think that's cute. I don't want to use names that like. For a girl. Oh, I just about fell off my shirt. For a girl. Okay, wait. I have so many, and some of them I'm gonna get judged for so hardcore, but they have meanings behind them. Okay. Okay. For okay, I like the name Blake for a boy or a girl. Same. Um. Okay, I like the names Viola and Esther. Viola sounds like Viagra, which isn't a good name. No, but I like the name Viola and Esther. They're both my great grandma Amy's sisters. I just think they're pretty names. Okay. Um. I so if they get something else, that's why. Okay. Also. Don't judge me for this. I'm probably not going to actually name my child this, but I just had surgery, and my nurse, 
I literally talked about her for days. Like, I literally cried when she left me at my bedside. Well, I was already crying, but I cried even more. Like, I was so sad. Her name was Mina, and I just think it's a cute little name. And she's just, yeah. I just love my nurse. So I put her name in my baby name's notes. Because I want, yeah. But I don't, I don't have, like, any good I have, like, names. no, I put some of them on my list, and I'm like, why did I put that on my list? Yeah, same. But, like, I really like <coughs> the name, uh, like, boy Milo, too. Oh, my gosh. Okay, never mind. I can't tell you. That shit, that shit was good. Hmm. I don't know, like, boy names. And I think ever it's a cute boy name. But I kind of like with, like, I like having themes. Like how, yeah, like how I'm not like when the names match. Yeah, like how, okay, so like, like all my brothers Jer- Josh, like Josh and Corey, John and Corey, not Josh, John and Corey, like their kids' names were uh, Bentley, Cooper, and what's the other one? Not Jai. Bentley, Cooper, and Lincoln. Those are all car names. And so it's like they all. Like, so they all like, match. Yeah, they all match until. Um, yeah. So, like, I like that theme, so it's, like, I could totally go for, like, having, like, themes of it, and if I did, like, cities, like, it could be, like, um, like, Dallas, Boston, I don't know, what are other names? Like, just, like, cities, you know? Chicago. Chicago. St. Paul. New York Pier. Have you guys ever seen the like clip of Keeping Up with the Kardashians where like it's when Northwest was like younger and Kim Kardashian was like she was like pointing up at the sky and Kim Kar- Kim was like and okay, so Kim is talking to Kendall and Courtney and Courtney's daughter Penelope is like with like sitting on Courtney's lap and the North is there. And Kim was telling them, she's like, last night, North and I were looking at the stars, and she pointed up, and I said, that's the North Star. And then North was like, and that's the Penelope Star, and the Mason Star. And Kim Kardashian was like, no, honey, there's only a North Star. And then it shows Courtney's face, and Courtney was like, why? <laughs> She's like, this is the stupidest thing. Who's your favorite Kardashian? Kardashian Jenner. I know people don't like Courtney, but I like her because she's just kind of like, I don't give a crap. Kylie. Because she's like inspired a lot of people. Like, because she's so tall and she wears heels like that, like. Are you talking about Kylie or Kimball? Kylie. I Are like you talking about Kylie or Kimball? Okay, Kendall seems cool, but she also gives off, like, I'm better than you vibes. But I like Chloe. She's funny. I like Chloe. She's just, like, I don't know. Kim K? I like him. I don't care what anyone says. I like him. <laughs> She's not my fave. Rip. She's not my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> Do you guys know who Hailey Bieber is, right? Yeah. Do you guys like her, do you think? No. Like, based on... You don't like her, do you? She's I'm fine. Not, I'm not um, like, eh, I'm I'm not, like, her like she's not one person that I invite to my dinner. Right. She's not on the level of, like, Gigi or, like, Bobby like, or whatever. She's, like, fine. I but guess. I do like her. I think her... <coughs> I keep Justin an eye out for Bieber Selena. Bieber are together. I don't care what people what say about about Selena? I just think people need to move on from her. Wow. Like, I don't get why wow. people are obsessed with that. No, I really don't care. I, think, I agree. I don't, it's like, like, let them live their own lives. Like, literally, they're married now. Selena got married? No, I mean, Justin oh, and Haley are like, married, and, like... People still give Haley. Or what's your face? Haley? Yeah. They still give her They still are so mean to Haley Bieber because she's married to Justin Bieber. And she's like, not Selena Gomez. Yeah. It's kind of sad, like, but it's just, kind of funny at the same time. I'm just like, people can like, get over it. Like, get their own lives. Why do you guys... People, like, attack 
them because she's not Selena Gomez. I'm like, dude. It's pretty messed up, I do have to say. I feel bad for her. But so much. You know, there's not much else we can do other than support from a distance. Is there anything (laughs) else you guys would like to say before we head off? If there was an apocalypse, zombie apocalypse, okay. broke out, besides any, like, guns or, any, like, that type of weapon, and you had to use something else, what would you pick? You can only like, no bow and arrows? I would choose, like, a spear. No, like, a no spear, no knives. No guns. Wait, what do you mean, then? What, what would you use as a weapon? Crutches. Bats. No. I would use, like... Barbed wire fences. Or like a bat wrapped in barbed wire. Yeah, like in Walking Dead. Yeah. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah. I don't know. That's kind of hard. Probably a bat wrapped in barbed wire. I feel like that's like that's like the (coughs) best answer. Like, what else are you gonna use? That's like up to that level, other than guns or. Um, okay, I think that's all that we have time for today. (laughs) Thank you for joining us, um, and I hope you have a great, 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 great day. You guys want to say that? No. Bye. Bye. Oh, fun, fun time. Fun, 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 fun.